Aaron Chekhanover, Avram Harsko, Aaron Chekhanover, Avram Harsko, and Irving Rose. October 6, 2004, the first Israelis ever to receive a Nobel Prize in Science are named. Technion Professor Avram Hershko and Technion Professor Aaron Shekhanover. Their work, the unveiling of the Ubiquitin system, advances humankind's understanding of the very essence of life, the human cell. The Ubiquitin system, as you probably know, is a fundamental process in cell biology. It's a system which no one dreamed existed until Professors Hershko and Shekhanover came up with the idea and tested it against the ideas that many other people had, namely that proteins in the cells undergo a cycle of renewal in which they are marked for degradation and build up again and renewal again. At the beginning, they were the pioneers in this area. Now there have been thousands of publications with major impact on human health, including medications, which have arisen based on the ubiquitin system to treat cancer and hopefully new medications in the years to come. The very fact that this Nobel Prize was conferred in the area of chemistry fulfills the driving mission of the Technion, which is an interdisciplinary mission, and all the leadership throughout the years, they've been right. They've been right all along in merging the ideals and ideas of a technical university with all the disciplines, including health and medicine. I'm very proud for myself, for my family, and also for the Technion, which is my home institution. I grew up in the Technion, I did my PhD in the Technion under the supervision of Avram Hershko, the other laureate of the prize, and uh, the Technion is not a simple organization. We are relying heavily on the good heart and open heart of Jews all over the world that have supported us along the years, the American Technion Society and wonderful people who have gone with us a long way. I am very grateful uh, to the American Technion Society. I was always very grateful. It was important for all this work. I don't think that this work could have been done without uh, your help. Once again, Technion affirms the power of the guiding vision of its supporters around the globe, this time earning the greatest recognition on Earth, the Nobel Prize.